guys, I'm just starting another weekend vlog. It's actually very close to Christmas now. I think it's 10 days. Um, I've just got ready for the day. Um, I'm actually just about to go and see my friend Charlotte. We're just going for a nice lunch um, for Christmas. And I've just put on this outfit, which is just pink jumper with this skirt and tights it is so cold outside so i'm hoping i'm not going to be absolutely frozen um but yeah anyway i will catch up with you in a bit once i've been out for food <laughs> hey guys it is a bit later now and i started oh a bit blurry it's not the best lighting here i'm afraid and I'm quite spotty at the moment. So I went out for lunch with my friend Charlotte, which was really, really nice. Um, I went to this really, really nice pub um, and had um, a really, really good pie, which was delicious. And um, Charlotte had pizza, which she didn't eat all of, so I've taken home the leftovers. She didn't want it, by the way. I didn't just nick it off her. Uh, so I might have a piece of that for my dinner. But yeah, back now feeling cosy in my jumper and I've literally put my joggers on <laughs> um it is really miserable outside it's really wet it's really cold not nice at all it is the 15th of December so in a week's time it'll be Christmas Eve time and yeah I'm super excited I haven't been feeling very festive at all but I woke up feeling festive this morning and um Christmas tree is on behind me. I'm going to watch The Princess Switch on Netflix now. And I've got my Christmas candle on. So I'm trying to pump pump up. I'm trying to dial up the Christmas vibes. I think Dan wants to go to cinema later to see Spider-Man. Which I'm not so thrilled about. But uh, yeah, that's fine. And um, I was going to tell you, I had a bit of a bad week. I've been really, really, really busy at work. I've got ill. Um, I'm still a little bit ill, you'll be able to hear, and then on Friday, I broke down on the way to work, and that's never ever happened, I had to call out the recovery guys, and it was really stressful, um, I actually sold my mini a couple of weeks ago, I don't know if you've, you would have seen it, if you've watched me for a while, but um, it was literally like, my dream car, I loved her <laughs> so much, she was white, and I had her for four years, and yeah, I loved the Mini so much, so it was really, I actually did cry when I had to sell it, so I bought Dan's brother's car off him for not very much at all, um, because he was buying another one, cut long story short, and it has been fine for him the entire time he's had it, and it literally cut out on me at the worst possible place ever, in the middle of a road trying to turn right into another road and I literally couldn't turn the engine on and it was really stressful. Luckily I had my two friends from work with me and they, bless them, tried to push the car to another road um, but they couldn't do it so we, luckily another couple of guys came and helped. Uh, yeah, basically I was stuck in the car for two hours, freezing cold while I was waiting for a recovery. It did turn up um, and my dad is having a look at it for me over like the weekend. Um, so hopefully I'll have another car next week, but oh, it's been stressful, but anyway, I had a really, really nice lunch today, and I'm hoping that now I can try and get festive, I have one more week left at work, so five days to get through, and then I have ten days off for what, for Christmas, or it might even be eleven days, so I'm so excited, but um, yeah, I will stop rambling now, I'm, I'm kind of hoping to show you some Christmassy things that we do this weekend, so yeah, hopefully that'll be good, and as I said, it is time for the Christmas, Christmas, the princess switch, which we did start the other day, um, or I did, but I need to finish it now, so yeah, Christmas tree is there, so yeah, I'm gonna watch this now, get cosy, and then have to go out again in a bit, morning guys it is Sunday and excuse my messy hair it is kind of third day hair and I can't be bothered too much more to it so I sound really bunged up as well again um I've just put a bit of makeup on but not loads because we're literally just going to be indoors all day but I like to cover up the spots you know it's actually a really really nice day today and I'm thinking that it would be nice to have gone out for a walk but I just got a few bits to do um I don't know if I if you remember but in my couple of vlogs ago um I said that I quite like to make lists um for the weekend and today 
I would like to clean the bathroom, which I'm going to go and do now. Uh, Dad's outside cleaning his car, so yeah. Uh, I need to water the plant, which is not going to take me long at all, but otherwise I'll just forget to do it. Gingerbread men. I really want to make some gingerbread men today. We like to kind of, I feel like it's become a bit of tradition for us to do that. And yeah, I want to see if I've got the ingredients already. I think I would have. I don't really want to have to go to the shop to get ingredients, which I'm being lazy, but yeah. So I need to see if I've got that. And then I want to wrap some presents and I want to sneak in a watch of the holiday or something. So I watched the princess switch last night, as you know. It was good. Very, very cheesy, but great. Um, and then I've heard that there's a couple more on Netflix as well that are even better. So I'm going to have a look at those as well. And we also watched the Strictly final last night. I'm a bit disappointed. I really wanted Joe to win and I did vote. Uh, so yeah, that was a shame. Uh, but anyway, it is Sunday and just need to make the most of today before I have to go back to work tomorrow. But five days to go, like I said, five days just come downstairs, funny lighting, I uh, just come downstairs to get my cleaning products and I thought I would show you uh, what I put them in. I bought these um, really good little baskets from the, pump, the pound shop, so literally a pound and I put all my um, stuff in here so that I can carry it upstairs, a bit lazy but it's just so easy that I can take everything in one go upstairs, literally just broken on me, it's not actually broken but I need to, <laughs> I need to fix that. I have ticked one thing off my list which is cleaning the bathroom so that is great and I've just been um, searching through, sorry about the light, that's okay, uh, I've just been searching through our baking bits and I have managed to find all the ingredients for gingerbread men so I don't need to go out. So I've got ginger, to be fair this is potentially not enough but they'll have to do, bicarb, some baking golden syrup, some plain flour, some brown sugar, I literally cannot believe I have this in the cupboard, amazing, an egg, some cutters and then I've got butter in the fridge so this is all hopefully going to go to plan. I've just gone upstairs now to our second bedroom slash office area and um, we tend to kind of wrap our presents in here because downstairs we have wooden floors so it's a bit cold and a bit uncomfy. Um, I was just looking at all the wrapping paper we have for Christmas, just seeing what we have to use basically and it's such a mix mash, mix mat, mix match, I can't speak today. There's so many different types of wrapping paper from like the previous years of us buying it and I really didn't want to waste what we already have so I've not gone out and bought any more this year, we're just going to use what we have um, so yeah what I've done is I've laid it all out, we've got this really random gold and white one here, I think Dan bought that one, this is literally from like a few years ago, um, it's like a yeah interesting print, this is like white and brown which I like, I bought this last year, I really really like this, I think it's like really cool. Um, it got a nice brown and red antler one and then a Christmas tree one. So a bit of a weird few. I think ideally I want to maybe use these ones the most because they're kind of red and brown and white. And then I've got all these tags. I actually bought these this year. They're recycled gift tags from Paper Chase. Um, I got these from m and I thought I needed more than I do because I, I already had these which they're okay I'm not sure they're going to go very well I've got this random one here but I don't want to waste it and I don't particularly like these that much but they can just be if needed basically and then I've got some red ribbon the only thing I don't really have and um, I want a couple of gift bags random plant here by the way the only thing I don't really have which is a bit of a shame is any like rosette things are they called rosettes? Um, so I don't know if we might just do a majority of our wrapping and then we can like add things on like that. Um, I might go into town and find some of those. So yeah, feeling very prepped now for the day. We have finished the gingerbread men. They are good. Dan made a little Santa. Pretty good. I made a weird elephant. 
just because. And Dan also made a Paddington bear. So cute. Then a little biscuit and then more gingerbread men over here. Woohoo! I will leave the recipe in the box below if you're interested. And now we're going to have some lunch. It is later now and we were wrapping some presents. And I have been watching the holiday. Uh, and now I'm doing dinner. Uh, I'm doing roast. So I've got some roast potatoes boiling here. Or painting my nails as well, Christmassy. Um, I've done some parsnips which I need to put some oil, honey and some salt and pepper on. Um, I've cut up some Brussels sprouts. I really like doing Brussels like this with some butter. So frying it up. And then we've got some carrots and then the chicken is in the oven um, which should be ready to come out soon and then I'll pop the potatoes in. So yeah, I'm just going to do the potatoes and get them in. It is actually the week after I was last vlogging. I've realised my glasses are reflecting. It is Friday and it is it was my last day at work today amazing please excuse the mess behind me i am in the second bedroom doing some wrapping for christmas because dan has gone to the hairdressers and yeah i needed to wrap some presents while he wasn't here so i am surrounded by presents here this one is not christmas because it's my nephew's birthday so i've got christmas presents going on here these are filled with presents in here and then i've got even more over there as well so Oh, and then I'm also watching the holiday calendar on Netflix, which I would recommend. So far, I've watched, I don't know, 30 minutes. Not bad, not bad. I thought I would end this vlog here. I've actually edited um, the rest of the vlog, uh, so I want to get this ready and then up the weekend before Christmas. Uh, so yeah, I'll do that and then I really hope you have a lovely lovely Christmas and I will see you soon and Thank you so much for sticking with me this year This hasn't been my finest year of getting up lots of content But thank you so much for everyone that's kind of watched my vlogs and has stick stuck around with me I really really appreciate it because I know I don't put in as much as I should with this but I won't keep repeating myself, but thank you so much and have a great one and I'll see you soon. Bye.